It is that time of year again. Today, the IRS will begin accepting tax returns and it is about two and a half weeks earlier than last year with the numerous stimulus checks and child tax credits. Max Mass explains the key factors you need to be aware of and what the IRS commissioner is now urging. Well, first and foremost, you need to account for the stimulus checks or any child tax credit checks that you got over the last year. Now, you should be getting a letter from the IRS if you haven't gotten it already. And just in case you don't or you forgot how much money you got from the government, you can check IRS.gov. The IRS is warning that a resurgence of COVID infections on top of less funding authorization from Congress well, that could make this filing season particularly challenging. The IRS commissioner saying the pandemic continues to create challenges, but the IRS reminds people there are important steps that they can take to help ensure their tax return and refund don't face processing delays. So here's the thing. Avoiding a paper tax return will be more important than ever this year to avert those processing delays. The commissioner is urging taxpayers to file their returns electronically and opt in to get their refunds by direct deposit. If you have any questions, the IRS is encouraging people to use the online resources before you try to call. Last filing season, as a result of COVID, the tax changes, and broader pandemic challenges, the IRS phone services, they received more than 145 million calls. In terms of refunds, last year's average tax refund was more than $2,800. And this year, more than 160 million individual tax returns are expected to be filed. The IRS says most taxpayers will receive their refund. You can receive your refund within 21 days of when you file. That is, if you file electronically and if you choose direct deposit and there is no issue with the tax return. We know this can be a complicated process, but most of the forms you need are on irs.gov slash forms. Now remember, the deadline this year, April 18th, three days later than normal. But if you really need extra time, you can file for an extension. That should give you until October. Guys, back to you.